Hello, everyone. In this, what if, what if Ash Williams was the S.H.I.E.L.D. hero? Yeah, you didn't see this one coming, did you? To my subscribers? No, you did not see this coming. And for those who are not subscribed to my channels, I did not met, I did not, I did not, none of my other videos mention this what if. If you look past my other what ifs, I did not mention this. Surprise! That's, it's gonna be one of those what ifs, which I'm just gonna surprise everyone. <clears throat> some may be obvious, some, you're not gonna see that coming. And, hold on. As for the RoboCop what if, I did a little, uh, I kind of, and I'll be raising the other photo and made, made this. I am, I'm not sure if it's, if it's good or huh, good enough. Well, anyway. Comment down below in the video to see which picture is a little better. Either this one or this one. This looks a little plain, but hmm, kind of fits the somewhat the common or areas to, to, to you know. And there's this one I kind of did a little tinkering with the background. This background. I kind of faded the photo from my wallpaper onto there in the background. It kind of it kind of looks a little a little better. Well, okay. Leave it down in the comments down below. Either this plain one or this here. I'm sorry. This is the actual photo I kind of redo. Besides the background, you kind of see a little uh, different. And neither or this. Hmm. I I cannot decide which which one of these. Which I'm gonna ask my subscribers and or my viewers. Which one do you prefer? The option one, no, no, no redesign. Or option two, the redesign. Redesign two, redesign one. Or design one and redesign. One, two, two, one. Uno, dos. I'm not going to say threes, but uno, dos. Well, it might be hard to tell the the background, but uh, well, kind of more, more or less obvious. But if you set your brightness on high, just a, more or less on that high, you might, might be either see it better. Better. And just, just, uh, I'm just gonna say it out there, up, or lay it out there, up, up. I mean, I did not see, I see the one and two movies and are the particular uh, YouTube story of Ash being the Marvel Marvel Universe and or the DC Universe. <clears throat> but I did not I did not see the TV show. I apologize for not seeing the not doing the doing it right, but uh, please go with it. So anywho, anyhow, or whatever, let's get to the story. We go to, for, or since I did not see the TV show, and since after the, the part two movie, he, I believe he, at, at the end of the, of the movie, and 
the TV show, he continues to fight the uh, evil demons and or creatures. So, what, like, like canon. The story was to show up the day after the the final episode, the final what if, but uh, whatever. Let's just say. <clears throat> That's what I was gonna make this make this part up. He is nearly at the end of the journey of truly defeating the 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 evil way or the evil army and our king that is running around above the mainland is of in hell. The fight between Ash and the evil ones were out of its struggle. There they're they went blow the blow, taking the hits after hits. Some a little ticked off that some evil ones just crossed the below the belt. Whoa. Which means, to, well, yeah, uh, it's that is my apologies for the story. We go to the point of them resting, Ash, <clears throat> questioning if is it really nearly the end. He's he's questioning about it in his head over and over, and some of the other parts of the the group. Came back for the little, or for the from uh, from the other parts of a historic library for any details and or other books. Give out the location and or help advice of more details about to quickly eliminate them, eliminating them. One of them carry some particular tools that might be in help, and the other were carrying the books. That person was able to put the book on the table, but the one on top, without them noticing, fall off from the top and stumble, stumble, stumble its way towards Ash. Ash is a little annoyed of some of the group was not. Ugh, can't believe this, these idiots. He, he grabs the book, about to check it, but, uh, he took, you know, he took a glance in. <laughs> Four cardinal heroes. Huh. Eh. Since, it, since, it, they're rather rather around that time to rest for for how, who knows how long but being alert of of any any upcoming battles so <clears throat> he decided to eh, might as well since I got time to spare eh, might as well read hmm. a spear hero A sword hero. A bow and arrow hero. Or the bow hero. The shield hero. <laughs> well, stupid, but the sh a shield would have been. A little more handy at some of my fight in some of my fights. <laughs> he go on to the, he went on to the next page and blank. Uh, what? Well, okay, okay, there are plenty of pages for the spear hero. Plenty, plenty of pages for the sword hero. Plenty of ugh, dull pages. For the 
for the bow hero. But no words whatsoever about any other words for this for the shield hero. And what the hell's going on? The, the place is going on their own. Oh no 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 no! Not again! Not again! Not again! Before he realized, he's been teleported to another world. And so he, there he is, a picture of him in canon when he, how he enters the, we took enter the time tunnel to the past. Except he's not, thankfully he is going to a somewhat medieval era, but not the one on Earth, but the one in another world. He reached towards the end of the t of the particular teleportation tunnel, and ugh, what the not the shit again? Ugh. What the hell is up with that? Ugh, what kind of book was that? Uh, no, tell me I'm not. I'm in the freaking past again. Ugh, how, what is that deal with these books? It's Gah. Oh, all right. My... Ah. Crap. I don't even know how to get back. Wait a minute. What? Ah. If it's if if it involves that stupid book for me to get back back to my home or ah. back to the battlefield. Uh, where's that stupid book? Which he cut. A moment later, he he even heard of greetings. Welcome, heroes. As shit around, what, what the? Wait, he spotted three, four medieval. Uh, in his point of view, uh, primate, little, like in canon, in or how he pronounce, how how he sees those medieval characters, those up uh, prime, uh, medieval primates, or like like that. Besides looking at those those guys, and he spotted three, three kids. Two look like. They might be in high school. The other looks like he he's in college. A blonde-headed dumbass, which he will know later on, which we already know. He's a he's a stupid blonde-ass dumbass. I would hate the blonde guy, the, the spear blonde guy, but he is. We have in some in some some point of view, he's somewhat the puppet and are being manipulated. Which technically there are some out here in the real world who do not do not even know they're being mani manipulated. Either would I. Technically, I'm one of those idiots. In anyway, the four, three or four mages, or I believe that's what they are, done their speech. But before any of the one of the other three other heroes were gonna do their response in canon, but before they do that, some of the words from behind them took the words right out of their mouth. What the hell? What the hell is is going? Why the hell are you, you you did not even you you morons were the one that summoned us here, me here. <sighs> I'm going to, if you don't return me to my home, right now, I'm going to kick your ass. Which, everyone's a little shocked of how he looked and or his right hand, which, which Ash did not know as the shield till after he's been calmed down. The mages did their explanation as in canon to escorting them to the king. 
Ugh, there's always a freaking king. He looked back and said, said to the three kids, Come on, rookies. We, we got a stupid job to do. Or, I'm, I'm sorry. One moment. He turned around. He turned around and checked, checked the kids. And noticed, wait a minute. Spear hero. Sword hero. Bow hero. No, uh, wait. Where did he check? His left arm. Wait a minute. Wait, wait. I'm the, I'm the shield guy? Well, ugh. well, wait a minute. He, he does his thinking as in canon, which, thanks to his other encounters in the past, some type of perp, one of those purpose, how the, some of the screw-ups, he kind of realized, alright, I'm kind of screwed. Which, he, 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 he shoved the, Ignore that. Tell the three. All right, you three, come on. We let's see what we can do. How to get get our get get our asses back home. Which they they got a little shook shook and are agreed with him, and off they go over to the king's chamber or the main hall. They went out to their. Over to the to the king's chamber or the main hall. All of them gathered together and so forth. The king showed up. Or and are waiting for them to show up. They do a little uh, somewhat uh, how they do in canon, but except Ash a little uh, how he's usual or <clears throat> Yeah, 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 all right, your, all right, your highness. All right, since that this stupid greeting is over with, could you skip skip to the point of how you can set our asses back home? Which, and so did the others who also agree, agreed with him. One by one, the king answered the questions. The question, I am sorry, you cannot return. Only if you, the only way you can return to your homes, if, if you can defeat the spell which brought you here is also the one that can only give me access only after the waves have been defeated or have been eliminated permanently. Which... They're a little ticked off. What? No! Which, Ash, set forward a bit, said, oh, What if we do not and we force some some of your asses to send, our, to send us home now? Which, the king, frustrated, outburst, Even if you force, force your way back home, you will not be able to return home. Only if you eliminate the waves, then you know that. Therefore, you you will be rewarded your way home. Even if I wanted to. That's the way the stupid spell work. How it's supposed to work. Ash, however. He calmed himself down. Right. Right. So. Alright. Besides that. When is this wave going to show up? No, 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 no. I'm sorry. I did a little copy job. <clears throat> uh, redo, redo. Oh, hold on. They enter the to the main hall towards the king. They gather together. Ash, no hesitation. Alright, yep, you asked this. What how 
Can you explain why you summon up summon our butts here? As you can see, I'm in no mood to, have to do any charity work. The situation, if you don't even know, if even they don't know. I'm a little preoccupied with a but about to end a certain threat in my in my where I'm at. If you'd be so kindly to sit our or send my ass back home, I'll be glad. To not kick your ass. Which he pointed his chain, his right hand, like, towards the king. The king, even if I wanted to, the stoop, the spell can only send you home, only when the waves have been def, have been ex eliminated. Which. The others were, besides Ash, what? No, you, you can't do. Santa home. Santa's home now. You, you did not ask for our permission to summon our, our butts here. You kept took away from us from our home. Do you think we would just do this for free? Even if we're, you were stuck, our butts is stuck here. Do you, you think we're gonna do this? Do this, chair? Carry work like 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 the, like the chainsaw guy said. You think we're gonna do this for free? It in our point of view, you owe us. No, no, you don't owe our butts. You owe us for for dragging our butts away from our home, away from our family. Ash was a little glad to hear hear from the from the sword guy. You heard him, Keen. So why's it gonna be? The Keen? <sighs> like, like I said. Even if I wanted to. The spell that sent you here can only be used again once the the waves have been defeated. Or and or eliminated permanently. So it kind of goes as it can, but they go through the names, the bow hero, go for, pronounce his name, the sword guy, pronounce his name, the spear guy, with his name, the king, was going to, but, he kept, doesn't want to, but, he asks, so what is your name, sir? <clears throat> My name is Ash Williams. He says his his information of where, where he worked and goes a little story of how he ended up how he is we know today. Which it took about um, hmm, two, three, let's say three hours for the story. Of how it all started and how where he is now before he went to the world. To the other world. And for the last for the, for the last explanation of his story. And it is all thanks to a stupid cursed book made of the made the the cover and our pages made of skin and the ink from blood of the living as ink he kind of gives more explanation on other parts which he nearly forgot the bow and or the bow hero puked his lunch and or let's say hmm, it's hard to tell whether since each of them are from several worlds hard to tell if they're as at the same time zone or it was late at night or he barfed the bow hero barfed up some food that he that he ate the spirit hero nearly nearly throw up 
the sword guy. Oh, disgusted. The king. No. What? And the king said, No, wait, no. He. Same situation as I am. Nearly the same situation as this, that I am. <clears throat> Which. You kind of understand how. And kind of thought of what Ash would have was was like before he became this type of person. In order to understand his point of view, he kind of questioned. At, at that point, he questioned. At that point, which took about for them took about an hour for the king to respond. In the king's point of view, he's questioning to himself. Did the what? What's, he's what are you questioning about? Hmm. He is questioning about the church, of what he of what he's been told about the sh shield hero, which he went to the conclusion that perhaps the shield hero from the past is is a little different. Or perhaps is a little different. Or I am I apologize for the story not going what you expected. Which he went to the conclusion that the, the shield hero in front of him is not like that 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 man and our person from where he's been told of. He's not that type of person. Which is a little struggle for him to shake what he'd been told off. Uh, it went to not exactly as common, but a little different. They had their lunch, or, or I believe, din they had their dinner, and given more details about the waves. And so... We go to where, go to the particular Pacific, Pacific room in canon. They have their little talks, and especially towards Ash, which as Ash was a little, eh, a little, I know, a little annoyed, but he's kind of glad that he wasn't the only one being dragged off of this world. Which they go to, to the conclusion of. They're from separate worlds. Three from a video game and one from a book. And Ash is tick off, tick pissed off about a book sent him sent him to that world. Now Ash ha hates it with all his might hates two books now. That hold on. I forgot the name of the book, which you know very well, and the book labeled The Four Carnal Heroes, which the bull, the bull, little shocked at, wait a minute, they end up being from a game, and the other got teleported to this world from, from a book. Which, Ash, a little to shake off his anger about about another book be now become his pain in the ass again. Which he goes into detail of his other his in-depth pain because of encountering that stupid book which he encountered from, from in the woods. The story had been told the three want to believe it's a, a lie, but they look over to his hand, his right hand. Wait. For those who are questioning about the chainsaw, let's not forget it, its main purposes was to cut and or cut wood, which. <clears throat> 
The shield may not even know about it, but let's not forget it's attached to his hand, which you cannot tell from it being a weapon and or a natural body part. Let's say it, let's say for story's sake, it'll act, go as is, or hold on. Let's just say it functions how it normally, normally does, except for where it goes to the park for the shotgun, which we'll, we'll see how it goes later on, later on in the story. Which, he separated the chainsaw from his hand, as he does in canon, or from the TV series, from the trailer of it. And he shows what used to be his left, his right hand. Ugh. Yep. And he goes, which, in my point of view, in somewhat logic, to the story of a particular... Another evil part, like the old Superman video or movie. The Superman has been toxified by a corrupt, generic kryptonite. The evil one had spread out the good part of him, which being like that. Even though that evil part of me grow out of me from the right side he kept his right hand but I'm stuck with with a with a numb here it make no freaking which literally it make no freaking sense even though it came right from the right side he he kept a good right hand but our main man stuck with a numb with a knob Nub. Which it took about ten minutes for the rest to for the rest of the three heroes to calm down. <sighs> Alright. Alright. I, I apologize. <sighs> Which they go into details on their weapons. They go on to their weapons and as in cannon. And when they gone to the shield hero, or Ash. Oh, hold on. I'm sorry again. They they go on to Ash's point of to Ash. Ash being a little ticked off that he did not get any, did not get those those other weapons, but he's a little glad that at least he have some better protection than what he had. Which, he's so glad he still got his shotgun, which he tried pulling out. <laughs> the fuck? What? Come. What the hell? He grabs again. What? No, no, no. But wait. We're now... We're not allowed to grab any other weapons besides our own? <sighs> Which Ash, even though it shows up in his display, he ignores that and grabs the shotgun. Which he was able to hold and laugh out of madness. <laughs> Can't do anything now, huh, you little, you stupid shield. <laughs> Which, the shotgun went up to the air. And where did it land it? Right on the shield. Which, a flash of light appeared. <laughs> Which, the others, uh, uh... Hold on. Everyone in that room was questioning, what, what is happening? Like, what happened to the shotgun? Ash, questioning that, Questioning that too. They checked, and a moment later, it show up again, but except on his left arm. Ash is questioning 
No. Which the yeah, others come to the conclusion. If some particular items can be certain items can be absorbed to the she to their uh, to their weapons, which over time can form into different type of weapons for them. Which Ash was a little questioning if he would be able to get it out again, but get it out from the shield, and are glad it, or <clears throat> let's just say Ash has mixed feelings. Ugh. I'm not gonna get that shock if I don't know if I'm gonna get that get the shock kind of get, but holy beep, look how badass the shield is. <laughs> Which since is a magic item, it has evident evident shots. Like the bow hero. There are no arrows, but limited, unlimited shooting. Which, oh, hold on. He turned to the bow hero and s responded, Hey, check it out. We have unlimited shots. <laughs> Which, he clashed his shotgun shield to the bow. Ting. <laughs> Stop wondering the heck out of Ah, oh, man, I hope I get the shotgun back. When I get it for... Man, I hope I get to, get to keep this shield. When I, when I get home. We have we have no idea, but... You're gonna be surprised how I end, end the... in this series. In this series. And so, it's the next... Which... <clears throat> Later... One two minutes later, they go to conclusion back to the shield and our weapons, which all of them go to the conclusion. Conclusion, even though it has no weapons, but its defense is pretty high, higher than three of three of them combined. Or, or I forgot to mention this part, but or let's say they realize it just now about the heads up. The sp after, and they go up to to see how they grind up their levels, and so they go on back to Ash. He's he realized he found the level he is in, and hmm, how what level is he? Hmm. Well, thanks to the certain book and traveling or to the past and or certain parts of the country. I would say he's, I would say a 10. I believe he would be a 10 on, on, on a level, on that level. I'm going to say, I'm going to say 10 right right now. He's at level 10, which he, he said, well, huh? Well, hope you guys get get catch up to me. I'm at, I'm at level 10. Which, they were... Wait, what? How? Oh, wait a minute. Let's, let's not, guys, don't forget about, about about what he went through. That's how he might have got level 10. Oh, oh crap. I nearly forgot about... Crap. Again, sorry how you went through, through that, but man, you're... You think all all that you would have gone a, a, a level higher than us, more higher, more low than that? Huh. You think? Huh. You, yeah, but huh. anyway, it is the next day. It somewhat goes in canon, which, hmm. huh? How should I go for this route? <clears throat> hmm. Since it's a little different than canon. I'm going to leave it up to you guys. Cliffhanger. Yep. 
It is a prize what if and or another cliffhanger. <laughs> yep. Not sorry. I'm sorry, not sorry. Well, even though I went to the set about the two what ifs, what if Izuku or Deku was, had mutation quirk of Fred Red Burger. For the love of God, why did you go with that what if? Laughter. The what if universe needs laughter. <laughs> and the second what if, what if Izuku Midoriya or Deku had the green machine quirk? Green because of his hair. And I'm going to leave the machine parts to your imagination of what did it, what does that mean? I'm going to leave it, leave it up to you guys. I'm going to leave it to you guys' imagination in the comments down below. What type of... What, or, eh, we're past that point. Well, I have no idea how that or I'm a little flattered with the numbers... That is all my subscribe subscribers, but technically all that is basically you YouTube's algorithm. Like I said in the uh, my, in my in my other videos, only five subscribers. Well, technically six, which <clears throat> only have five subscribers only. But I'm fine with the numbers, but uh, a little sad at not an actual legit. Subscribe, subscribe, sub subscribers. For those who are new to my channel, please do not forget to leave a like and or subscribe. Especially comment down below of what of how should I do what should I do next in the, in this what if. And uh, thanks to my subscribers for showing the love and coming down comment and leaving a like. Down below uh, in my videos. I'm well in my before I done the what if I was doing 50-50 making a what if for for the love of making the for 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 the what ifs and the other half is to make a little money out of it by selling little stickers and our that crap but by going through more research some who do go over that route end up being scammed, robbed. All oh, that merch. Um, some of those merch, but uh, I was kind of hoping of further down the road, me getting more popular on at least two thousand of to four thousand legitimate subscribers. Telling my subscribers. You want, um, oh, let's see, let's see if it's possible to turn one of those holographic type of photos, you know, one of those old-fashioned photos, old-fashioned, old uh, uh, photos, then I'm having a holographic effect, where you look at it and are turning it left, right, or how you look at it. I was thinking of turning that one page. Turning that type of pit, that type of idea into a comic and or manga. Yeah, that, that was what I was thinking of doing doing and or planning or hoping to just put that out there. One page of a from from a holographic picture is basically like three pages, or if you plan it out right. It's basically, it's basically, it is basically three pages in one. Which, even though it does acquire some light to, to see it, but it's technically electric, electricity free. And for some parts, we'll have legitimate, awesome motion. Motion inside the action in the page. Like how some manga or or whatever you think of, or My Hero Academia, one of those manga chapters. <laughs> yeah, you know very well if one of those scenes on those type of pages, 
<laughs> oh man, it, it was gonna it will be awesome. Or jawsome. <laughs> And I was thinking of actually uh, that one of those type of uh, holographic companies that were planning to to use a 3D or to use a printer to make a three or to make a holographic printable picture. I was thinking of acting them and see if it's possible to redo the algorithm to see if be able to do a, a comic and or manga chapter page. I was hoping down the road of doing or doing at me doing doing that see the joy of other comic comics and or manga enthusiasts out there in the world see how their reactions to my to that idea of mine. Well, I thank you. I thank you all, every one of you, for taking your time to watching the or hearing the all the way to this point in the video i thank you very much for taking your time and hope hope to see you or to see you in my next what if perhaps maybe one of your names being a character in one of those what ifs you never know you never know <laughs> well i thank you guys for watching the video thank you every one of you for leaving a like and comment and subscribe to my to my what if. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Take care now. Bye bye then.